morning, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, students and traders. Sound check, sound check, all right? This is Michael DFX Freedom broadcasting you live on YouTube and other streaming platforms, everybody. And this is the Professional Forex Trading Course 101. Happy Wednesday, happy Wednesday. Everybody remember, tra never forget, trading is a learnable skill when you learn in the correct way. When you learn in the correct way. And you are going to graduate from this course, everybody. Once, number one, you have your chart set up and ready for trading. Number two, you have your strategy in place. You understand why you win, why you lose. Number three, you have a complete understanding on how this market works so you can analyze the market and make an educated prediction. For Hello, for questions and homeworks, you have the email. Send me an email to the Gmail. You know? And you, for class lessons, everybody, workshops, whatever, you have to use, we are using Skype or Zoom, right? Skype or Zoom time to time. And everybody, we are full, all right? We are full, we don't have any more spots. Okay, this is over, we are full, we cannot accept anymore. We have 20 people, thank you very much for your trust, everybody. All right, moving forward, moving forward. And give me a second, everybody, workspace open. There you go. All right, let's start to read the chat, everybody. He Wisdom says hello, everybody. Everybody, Ernesto, hey, Wisdom. Hello to all of partners in this journey. 31 chapters and 80 still to come. Hello friends, hello boss, hello Lynn, hello Ernesto, hello Wisdom. Did you copy Telegram? No, please send the link. Have you created Telegram link, Telegram group? Yes sir, hello Broto, how are you? Ernesto, hello. This is the 32 session. Ernesto, have you created a group? Just do a search in Telegram, you should find it. By name, hello everyone, hello Clara, how are you? And Lynn says, do a copy. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, everybody. So zoom out, zoom out, zoom out, clean. All right, next chapter, right? Next chapter. Hello, Desert Island. How are you? Uh, this is from... Everybody, do yourself a favor. Everybody, do yourself do yourself a favor. Come to the advanced course. Everybody, do yourself a favor. Come to the forex course two o two. Okay. Do yourself a favor. Pay the price and come to the advanced course. Everybody. Okay. Stop crying and come to the advanced course. You know. The traders, some traders know that I'm talking to them, right everybody, you know, and I'm telling you, <laughs> this business is not what you think it is, alright, pay the price and come to the advanced course, okay, everybody, Clara, you are here, right, Clara, help me out, alright, everybody, give me a second. Where is the where is the picture? Now don't worry, I'm not going to stay a lot, you know, just quickly. Okay? Everybody, Clara is in number three. Alright? Clara is in number three. Okay. Julius and Sheila, you know, and a lot of people are in number two. Clara it's in number three. Clara, what do you think? Is this business what you were thought? Help me out, Clara. No, no, nothing wrong, nothing wrong, come on. Trading is a learnable skill. But the last two weeks, tons of emails. Oh, boss, I don't understand. Boss, help me, you know. I said, come to the advanced course. Do I need to pay? Of course you need to pay. You know? Of course. And everybody, I have a story to tell you, right? Five years ago, we gave the advanced course for free. Didn't work for you. It didn't work for the students. 
Everybody make sense? Pay the price and come to the advanced course. See everybody one more. One more. Clara is telling you everybody it's not what you think. It's not what you think. This business is not what you think. You have Julius telling you maybe your Danka is too soon, I don't know. Everybody. You have Chila telling you, now you have Clara telling you, guys, boys and girls, this business is not what you think it is. Lin saying to me, boss, sure, if I would love to graduate from this boss, however, what is the fee structure boss? Lin, it depends from where you live, make sense? Send me an, I don't want to waste too much time, send me an email, okay, or say hello on Skype. Okay, everybody, it depends where are you from and it depends if you want classes once per week or twice per week. All right. But just to tell you, stop crying. Stop crying, stop crying, stop crying. This you it's not your fault, but this business is not what you think it is. I need to find a trader who comes to the advanced course knowing what we are talking about. Make sense? Hello, Allah. How are you? Allah, you are you are another one. What do you think? Is this business what you thought? What you thought, or is this business something different? All right, everybody. Boss, I don't understand. What do you mean? Question. I receive questions every year. Can I make money from the forex course 101? answer yes you can yes you can then comes the better question boss can i make consistent money consistent profits from the forex course 101 no no you cannot all right everybody somebody has boss i don't understand what we're talking about this business is not what you think it is and here are traders like you telling you the same. Guys, it's really true. Uh, see everybody, Allah saying too. Something different. Broto, yes I can. Eventually, <laughs> eventually we all can make some pips and money, but being consistently profitable, as Allah knows, Clara knows, Julius knows, Chila knows. Step by step, your Danka is going to start to know. It's impossible. Make sense, everybody? This business is not what you think it is. All right? The, uh, boss, why are we learning then? Well, this is the structure, right? This is the structure. You need to learn. So the Forex Course 101, everybody, is the, what we call the analyst part. You are learning how to trade the market. You are learning how to, you are learning how this market works. All right. This is the analyst part. Okay. This is why you need to have your chart set up ready for trading. You need to have a strategy in place, a kind of. And you need to have a complete understanding on how this market moves, how this market works. So you can analyze the market and make an educated prediction. All right. Analyst, it's one personality. Analyst, it's one, let's say it's one uh, animal, you know, or a beast, right? right? A trader, it's something different. Okay. For, for the last time, this business is not what you think it is. I promise you, everybody. Okay. Yeah, we are using charts. We are using softwares. We are using Fibonacci. We are learning. But this is all part of how this market works. All right. You could be a great, great, great analyst and still making no money from the markets. Does this make sense to you? No, it doesn't, boss. Of course not. This is why. <laughs> of course not. This is why you need to come to the <laughs> forex course too. 
Everybody give me a second, I need to take the coffee, just a second. Second. All right, there you go. Any questions for the from the multiple time frames, everybody? Any questions for the multiple time frames? Now type in the chat, everybody, a currency pair that it's making you headaches. Today we are going to join the knowledge from support resistance pivot points and the three trend lines wisdom is asking uh, ernesto wisdom is asking for the telegram link in the meantime everybody first comes first is served okay type in the chat a currency pair that it's making you headaches okay and we are going to join the knowledge with from support resistance and pivot points and the three trend lines and hopefully increase your understanding increase your awareness on how this market works clara gbp usd all right thank you very much okay everybody let's go gbp usd gbp usd gbp usd GBP USD everybody Clara on what time frame on what time frame What time frame Clara GBP USD monthly chart one hour chart daily chart what time frame Out this one out this one out this one out this one there you go Very good Everybody, you should have your four charts so far, okay? You should have your four charts. Monthly clone chart. Weekly, one more time. One more time. Weekly clone chart. Daily, and one more clone chart the one hour two hour whatever time frame one hour all right I'm gonna buy okay everybody all right now let's make a pool what is the long-term view everybody now remember this is the skill it's not personal this is a skill what is the long-term view and what is the short-term view about GBP USD one hour chart everybody type in the chat what is the long-term view in your opinion on GBP USD one hour chart and what is the short-term view on GBP USD one hour chart Boss, what is the long term view? What is the short term view? The long term view means what is going to happen this weekend. Okay, great question. Thank you very much. Great question to the student. What does this mean? Long term view from the one. Remember everything. We've learned this concept already, everybody. You might just forgot it. Every single time frame has the long term view and the short term view so from the one hour chart long term is weekly perspective slash bias okay weekly perspective bias and what is the short term view 
on the one hour chart it's edit label it's daily you know daily or daily or the next day you know daily one two days maybe all right everybody thank you very much for the student he was asking boss what do you mean short term view long term view short term view means what do you think is going to happen this week with GBPUSD and the short term view what is going to happen maybe today or tomorrow all right everybody Clara says long term view is a buy Okay, everybody. Anybody else? What is your long term view? Everybody, don't be shy. We're here to learn, right? There is no right or wrong. What do you think? Okay, so. How do you come to an understanding what is going to happen on the one hour chart? What is the answer? Exactly the multiple time frame trading. Okay, everybody, today we have a test. Like in a school, today is test day for you, everybody. So we go on GBPUSD monthly chart and we have our support resistance pivot points. All right, everybody? We have our support resistance pivot point. Don't bother with the numbers, those are areas. Okay? Now, do we agree, everybody, that the market hit the lower band? Do we agree? Type in the chat everybody, yes I agree, type in the chat, no I don't agree. Do we agree everybody that the market hit the lower band? Circle and colors, background color like this and foreground color like this. Everybody, do we agree that the market hit the lower band on the monthly? Type in the chat, yes I agree, type in the chat, no I don't agree, all right. Now, do we agree, Clara, hear me out and everybody else, listen to me. Do we agree that the market, it's not in an extension anymore, from the monthly? Do we agree that the market was pushing higher and higher and higher and it's not extending anymore? And you can see it from the candles. Type on the chat, yes, I agree, or type in the chat, no, I don't. You don't need to agree with me, everybody. When you learn, it's where you disagree, make sense? No, I mean, if it makes sense, type in the chat, yes, I agree, but if it doesn't make sense to you, if you are seeing something different, feel free to type, no, boss, I don't agree. Because then I can talk to you and I can explain to you. Make sense? Hello, Julius. And everybody, if you want to talk to the traders, to Clara, to Julius, to Allah, connect on Skype, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram, and ask the guys, you know? Call Clara and, call, and ask Clara, Clara, what is this all about? The Forex course 202, you know? Ask Julius, Julius, how are you doing, you know? Yes, I agree, I agree, you know? We don't have a low yet, everybody. Desert Island, we don't have a lower low yet, not yet. So we agree that the market was moving up and up and up and up and, and it's, you know, it fini it's not extending anymore. Do we agree on this, everybody? Okay, so what is the long-term view and what is the short-term view? Can I copy maybe and paste can I do this paste wow 
everybody so what is the long-term view what is the short-term view on GBP USD monthly chart type in the chat everybody monthly long-term view XYZ and monthly short-term view XYZ Broto says I don't agree very good why not excellent Broto Broto is not agreeing why not how can you tell that this market is extending Broto? Let's have a conversation. Broto does not agree that this market stopped extending. Okay, very good. Broto, why not? Why would you say, oh, it's still in an extension? Ernesto, long term short, short term short. How do you know, Ernesto? Make sense, everybody? So Clara said it. I'm going to go swiftly because we have a lot to talk about today, everybody. This is a, uh, it's not difficult, but we have a lot to, to check, all right? So Clara said it best. Clara said it best on the monthly. It's in consolidation. All right, everybody? If you say short term short, you are not. Everybody pat yourself on the back and tell yourself it's all right. I'm learning a skill. I'm still speculating. I'm still speculating. If you say short term short, you are not trading from what you see. Make sense, everybody? You are speculating. You know the market there is there is nothing that is telling you oh this market is going to fall boss but you said that the market stopped extending should but Clara got it best this market so far tomorrow it's another story but this market so far it's sideways consolidation so it's not extending anymore it's not retracing yet it's in consolidation congratulations to you clara all right everybody do we agree candle candle can i mean you can also trace the if you connect the lows somehow if you connect the lows somehow something like this and like this and there you go clone Okay. Shola, long time long, short time short. All right. So Shola, same as Ernesto. How do you know? Wisdom, long term bearish on the monthly. No. Wisdom, the monthly hit the lower band. Long term long, yes sir. Short term consolidation, exactly. Everybody on the monthly chart, wisdom, please hear me out. On the monthly chart, when the market hits the upper band, goes to the lower band, right? Oh, uh, exit, everybody. Wisdom, I want to settings, preferences, chart. What is the chart general? Chart settings. Uh, no, this one. Give me a second. Settings, colors, preferences, general. Okay. Uh, time zone, day star, time zone. Let's go to UTC with GMT, UTC, 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 and apply and OK. Give it a second, wisdom. Oh, this is okay. So so far, it's like this, right? Okay, wisdom. You have uh, on uh, trading view. You have different brokers that you're going to see that those two are the bands. All right. Fair enough. If you are willing not to listen to me, it's all right. You know <laughs> what can I tell you? I mean, you know. But then don't call back crying. Oh, my strategy doesn't work. You know, whatever. Consolidation, consolidation, Broto, I agree, consolidation. All right, everybody. Okay, now, 
and as you can see as you can see this consolidation is happening near or between the two support resistance pivot points agreed everybody and remember it's not a line it's an area okay so it's going up so it's hitting here you know it's hitting here but then it gets a little bit out of the range and it's hitting here it gets out of the range a little bit so it's still reacting can you see it everybody or if you look at the bodies of the candles right you know there is no body on the other side and remember those are not lines those are areas now everybody should have now the three trend lines right so my i have the down trend lines from the very 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 top all right and i'm going to delete this one so far i'm going to do it later okay so the trend lines this would be the on the monthly yes sir so this would be the long-term trend line and like this and like this you know then remember we should not break tails or body so this would be one and let me see if i can do the medium term trend line starting from here not to break anything and then i'm going to have the short term trend line there is the tail all right everybody and that and now i'm going to have the long term trend line too right all right okay now this is you everybody being a great analyst first before you become a trader okay what is this chart telling you what is going to happen most likely tomorrow next week and the next two weeks or maybe a month type in the chat okay what do you think is going to happen maybe next month tomorrow maybe next two days to maybe next two weeks type in the chat what do you think boss how do you know address what you see you have you have an uptrend line that's been broken you have three downtrend lines that are still in place the market is clearly not extending anymore and the market hit the lower band breakout downhill how do you know it's going to go downhill it's going to drop down how do you know everybody you've learned you've learned that consolidation does not represent a trend line break wow this is going to be a quote for next year traders to listen to a consolidation break does not represent a trend line break golden nugget no i'm not going to write it down we've learned this in the previous lessons you know a trend line is broken when the market is trending not consolidating this is why most likely maybe i'm wrong this is why most likely clara is having a headache with gbp usd this is why most beginner traders have headaches with most of the currency pairs oh my gosh every time the time entering the market is not moving and the market is going nowhere or the market goes against me a consolidation does not represent a trend line break okay everybody golden nugget exactly so me me as michael you know what is going to happen i don't know i don't know trade what you see i don't know what is going to happen to the maximum to the best of my abilities as an analyst i'm going to say well the, i this market is going to continue in consolidation does this make sense to everybody 
7 out of 10 won't cross trend line. No. No. See everybody, it's a mindset. How you think. Okay? If you say right now this market is going to fall, you are speculating. Okay? You are speculating how many traders, how many traders shorted the market, shorted the market in here on the one hour, two hour, four hour chart and got stopped out. Short term. Make sense everybody? Yes, it's a speculation consolidation now this is your job everybody to learn make sense this is the skill this is the market trending right this is the market trending and the market broke the uptrend line made the lower low now this is desert island this is something different everybody this is something different. This, those two are not the same. And we've learned it. Which one does this look like to? Does this like like the example number one, everybody? Oh, the market broke the uptrend line and is going to fall. Or does it look like more number two? We've learned all of this from before. Matija, my friend Matija from Slovenia, how are you? Matija, I, I still have your money. When do you want to start the advanced course? Freedom, can we make a, one video about cancel and replace stop loss? Sure. Desert Island got it, Clara says too. Matija, I didn't, I didn't forget about you, I'm thinking about you. When you want to start, just send me a, a message on Skype. Number two, number two, number two. All right, all right, all right. So out, 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 out. Okay, everybody. This is you learning the skill. Don't speculate. Don't speculate. Okay? Now let's move. So I'm going to clone the chart and clone the chart and clone the chart, you know, and monthly chart. Give me a second, everybody. Here, here, there you go. Now we go on the weekly chart and then we go on the daily chart. Okay, so zoom out now, Clara. Where is your take profit? Can we start in June? Sure. Yeah, I'm sorry, man, you told me. Yes, Matia, you told me, I'm sorry. You were talking about June, July. Yes, sir. Absolutely, you are the boss. All right. Clara, where is your, where is your stop loss and where is your take profit? How many of you everybody had the aha moment how many of you said oh my gosh i got it boss what is the aha moment the aha moment is when you see the monthly and the weekly consolidation and you are buying and selling in between and the market never reaches your take profit and the market is constantly stopping you out. How many of you had an aha moment right now? Make sense everybody? If you're on the one hour chart, two hour chart, whatever chart, 15 minute chart, right? And you've entered long you've entered long this is multiple time frame analysis you've entered long because on the 15 minute chart or one hour chart you've seen an uptrend 
and you've entered long everybody in here on the white candle just an example okay on the white candle on the 15 minute chart one hour chart you're going to see an uptrend so you Clara just an example you Clara have entered here long buying right and now the market is reversing okay and you are talking to yourself oh my gosh you know again you know it was in this beautiful uptrend but now that I am entering the market now the market is getting against me again right and because you are trading the short-term trend or whatever and you have the stop loss in the wrong place you have the stop loss in the wrong place and the stop loss is not wrong on the one hour chart or the 15 minute chart but the stop loss is wrong on the bigger pattern the market is going to stop you out and then you are going to short the market everybody on the short term trend on the one hour chart 15 minute chart the smaller time frames and you are going to put the stop loss on the short term trend again guess what the guess what is the market going to do seven times out of ten take profit clara 1.243 1.24 Okay, so it's up in the consolidation, stop loss 118. Now Clara, why are you having troubles with this currency pair? If your stop loss and take profit is in the right place. Fernando, hello boss, how are you? I'm great, how are you Fernando? Como o senhor está hoje? Everybody do you understand this game gbpusd consolidations happens a lot happen a lot okay clara you have the take profit in the right place you have the stop loss in the right place why is gbpusd making you headache headaches I took away all the profit. Fernando saying good, all good. It took away all the profit. Everybody, <laughs> pat yourself on the back, everybody. Listen to what I'm going to tell you. And Clara, this is what you're going to learn in the, in the coaching sessions or in the advanced course with everybody else. Okay? Golden nugget. Golden nugget. Golden nugget. We suffer because of unrealistic expectations, everybody. Make sense? Golden nugget. We suffer because of unrealistic expectations. Boss, what do you mean? If you have console just an example, right? Clara and everybody else. If you have a consolidation and the market's making hard highs, so it's it's a confirmed consolidation already, right? It's a confirmed consolidation. And you enter here, you know beautiful entry counter trend line break whatever if you expect that this market is going to go up and up and up and give you money i'm sorry to tell you this is not what is going to happen boss it took all the money so what makes sense everybody those are unrealistic expectations you see you see a bearish i mean you see a huge bearish what happened today today we had the lambo trade everybody clone chart clone chart cajf jpy we had a lambo trade today cajf jpy monthly chart cajf jpy one hour chart right 
this was the Lambert rate for this from this morning okay so you are seeing something like this right you are seeing something like this or maybe so you are entering on the yes it's just an example you are entering on the one hour chart and on the 15 minute chart so let's make a horizontal line horizontal line you know you are here your entry time frame is the one hour chart you go on the 15 minute chart you know you are going to go on the 15 minute chart this is something that you see on the and you say oh my gosh the Lambo trade and now you go back on the one hour chart you know and you enter in here you know you enter in the next candle right so this is your risk and this is your reward down here one more time clone one two and this is your reward right and as soon as you enter you know the next two candles are, are, are blue but the third candle it's white you know and what happens right now you start to worry and as a matter of fact, you know, all the profit that it's be, that's been done, the white candle took it back to your entry. Boss, the market it all my profits. Good. What, what, what do you mean good? I mean, it's okay. But what do you mean it's okay? If you think that the market is going to just fall and fall and fall and give you the money, I'm telling you this is not going to happen. I mean, I would love to, right? We are all the same, everybody makes sense? I would love the market to be that generous. To me too. But it's not. Okay, everybody? Check your expectations. If you believe, oh, this is going to go straight up or straight down, it's not going to happen. But what would be a realistic expectation? The market must wave and the market is going to do so everybody this is the fibonacci that you're going to learn in the future you know so the market should go from down to here up to here this is the fibonacci sequence this is the projection just an example again this is the projection what would be a realistic expectation the market come down to here and the market can do anything it wants for how long it wants before it hits the the extension make sense everybody this is the realistic expectation another one until the pattern is there Clara and everybody else until the pattern is there you don't have anything to worry boss but i'm stressed out this is because you have unrealistic expectations type in the chat everybody does this make sense to you or it's too much philosophical and wishy-washy and oh you know give me something technical does this make sense to you we suffer because of unrealistic expectations you expect that every single trade that you are going to put in the market is going to be a winner that every single trade is going to make you money and i'm telling you this business is not what you think it is and i'm telling you one more time with clara ala and julius that are here pay the price and come to the forex course 202 period end of story stop crying make sense everybody oh you're so arrogant i'm not i'm trying to help you i'm trying to help you not arrogant until you come to the advanced course you have no idea what this business is about make sense boss is this why you are telling us that we cannot consistent money exactly this is one of those 
this is one of those it makes sense it's clear all right all right everybody what is the long-term view what is the short-term view on GBPUSD weekly chart type in the chat everybody what is in your opinion the long-term view so long term view and what is the short short term view what is the long term view short term view somebody is asking boss after finishing the forex course choo -choo, can i teach what you teach absolutely yes absolutely yes why not why not help each other everybody teach others make sense 95 if not 99 percent on youtube videos are poor bs make sense everybody and i'm not arrogant please understand i'm not arrogant but i am an institutional trader i've seen a lot in the last 25 years making money losing money me too doing the all the stupid things all the mistakes i'm not that arrogant to know everything but i've seen a lot and i learned from the best and it keeps going and going and going we know what works and we know what doesn't work so sure teach me i mean of course right long term view is a buy short term is in consolidation anybody else both consolidates at dirt island Phil philosophy is the best stuff says island eglis how to calculate the risk benefit any tool uh not that i know of everybody if anybody can help eglis he's asking how to risk benefit I mean me personally I'm doing it on Excel so Fernando is saying this is true it's the first time I found the real Forex course I'm going to dedicate this year to studying 101 thank you boss Fernando temos grupo in Portuguese também se você se consegue conectar on Skype I just told Fernando that we have a Portuguese group on Skype everybody long term short short term consolidation weekly right everybody this is the skill between clara saying that long term it's a buy and ernesto say, saying long term is short what is going to happen seven times out of ten please guys if you like this course let's give it a like muito legal si senor Fernando, what, what, what city are you from? We have traders from different cities from Brazil too. They speak English and Portuguese, not a problem. Yes, everybody, you can send an email to Ducascopy, whatever, you know, email, and tell Ducascopy Investment Bank. Thank you for the course. Okay? Ernesto, there is a few calculation online, but I have Excel to calculate risk reward. All right. Everybody, you have the monthly and you have the weekly. What is going to... Now, my friend Island is going to know the answer. What is going to happen seven times, seven times out of ten? Everybody... Ernesto is saying short term, long term short, and Clara is saying long term long. What is going to happen seven times out of ten? With the premise that the short term both agreed it's in consolidation. Everybody, when consolidation is over, 
Do you predict that this is going to happen 7 times out of 10 or do you predict that this is going to happen 7 times out of 10? I'm from Brazil. Sim, mas qual cidade? Qual cidade? <laughs> I know you are from Brazil. Everybody, what do you think is going to happen 7 times out of 10? You have the monthly view, you have the weekly view. And remember, this is the skill you should have acquired so far. Type in the chat, everybody, weekly up or weekly down? For me to understand that you think that this consolidation is going to break up or you think that this consolidation is going to break down? Fernando, man, we have our one of our best traders, Heraldo, it's from São Paulo. Um dos nossos melhores traders de São Paulo, se chama Heraldo. If you can connect on Skype. Hedge fund trader said, hedge fund trader Broto says short. Down. Anybody else? Market will go up long term. Continue uptrend, weekly up. Oh my gosh, Ernesto. Everybody, the premise is that the short term it's consolidation, all right? Don't confuse apples with bananas. Weekly chart short term is going to go sideways agreed everybody but then what is going to the market going to do next seven times out of ten is it going to push down or up fernando is going to configure the skype watching the wrong chart fernando are you brazilian boss yes i am Yes, I am, but I have the sortaki, how you say. I leave the broth a lot. Okay, Fernando, one of my parents is Brazilian, the other one is... Shola says push up. Push up. Push up. My friend, Desert Island. I need you. Okay, everybody. If the market, if the market pushes up, right? And what are you going to do when the market breaks up, everybody? What is the market going to do? There you go, everybody. Well, maybe not the lower band. Okay, maybe not the lower band, everybody. This is you. One more time. Uh, where is it? There it goes. No, not here. GBP USD daily, everybody exit full screen, put it in here. Weekly chart. Everybody, when the market gets up, out of consolidation, we need to move forward, we're almost out of time. And you are going to buy, right? Because this is what you are predicting. And you are going to lose. Why did you lose? What's the answer? What's the answer? Okay, Fernando, very good. Everybody, when you are going to, most of you not everybody, most of you say, okay, this market is going to go 
sideways and then it's going to break up and I'm telling you all right if this is the case the market is going to break up you are going to buy on the one hour two hour daily chart and then you are going to lose why did you lose pivot area no after the extension after the extension what must come everybody after the extension what must come boss but you are speculating agreed agreed we are agreed i agree with you but if this monthly candle closes we need to wait until the end of the month if this monthly candle closes anywhere like it is right now we have a low from the monthly and we have a high from the monthly and seven times out of ten a retracement must come a retracement everybody a retracement all right now fair enough three times out of ten three times out of ten the market could go up but those are concepts and if you are trading like this on the smaller time frames is it strange that you keep losing ouch difficult and difficult question you know boss you hurt my feelings everybody this is a concept we are looking at the monthly and the weekly you could be doing this on the daily and one hour and or the 15 minute chart 15 minute chart and, and the four hour chart make sense if this is how you process information and your belief is that the market is going to push up in a market wave isn't it strange that you are losing most of the time maybe not every single time but you are losing most of the time you enter in here go long and then the market goes into a retracement ouch you hurt my feelings well and believe me i understand you but i need to look everybody we are all the same we need to look in the mirror make sense and and accept that yeah you know maybe you know maybe the teacher is right yeah you know maybe i've been trading breakouts in the wrong with the wrong perspective make sense everybody let me say right now anticipating most likely the market is going to make a low with the current candle if not i'm speculating doing wrong very good now remember sometimes the market is going to push up fair enough but not most of the time so here you have it again trade what you see wait for higher highs higher lows and then you go long or wait for lower lows lower highs you know and then you go short make sense all right everybody thank you for your time see you back tomorrow until tomorrow stay strong and trade for freedom don't trade for money this business is